So with the release of the brand new Mythic character came a lot of customization. And with that, there's a lot of combinations with legendary and Mythic guns with this character. Matter of fact, there is so many. So today we're gonna give you guys some of my favorite combination. Essentially, we're doing a fashion show. But before we continue on with this video, let's give a huge shout out to Call of Duty Mobile for sponsoring this video. So like I mentioned, today we're gonna be combining a lot of Mythic and legendary skins with the brand new Spectre and give you guys a beautiful combination. Essentially, it's gonna be a bunch of Power Rangers. Matter of fact, if we can get this to 300 likes, it's a lot of likes, but if we do get there, we're gonna make a video with five other YouTubers with five different skins and uh, it's gonna be a blast. So 300 likes and we will work on that ASAP. So essentially, I'm gonna show you guys each of the palettes and the color scheme that we went with and then show you guys the legendary. Again, let me know which one you guys find is the best, but let's start it off. There is gonna be 10 total in quotation mark, but the last two or the first two that we're doing right now is gonna be bonus. I kind of had a hard time matching the base blue and gray just because there's not really that many that goes like the same blue, but I did manage to find one. So we'll show you guys the bonus ones that we have here. We have the Crick 6 Ice Trick. I really wanted to make this work because, you know, the Ice Trick skin is so nice. But with this, it's not the best. The combination is okay. Then we also have the same, but with the Fennec. I wanted to show off the Kimbo, but not the exact same blue. But this next one is the best one. You guys will see. Bang! The Locust Neptune, despite having pretty bad iron sights. It has some of the best combination is the coast closest one you can see the blues a little off but it's got the gray it's got a little bit of blue just like the character so this is the one that we're going to start off our list it's going to be number eight technically speaking but you can also use the build this is literally the build that we use uh specter let me show you guys how we did the mythic it is pretty much the base one and then the palette we we added carbon fiber you don't even need to add carbon fiber to be honest and i'm sure there's actually other guns you can do but we're doing the mythic and legendaries and then i'm sure you can go with some epics and stuff like that but with the carbon fiber and the base one this is what you're gonna get and if you guys want to use the guns this is the build that we're using uh, just sniping I'm not a great sniper, so this might not be the best build. All right, so before we continue on, I just want to mention that most of these are going to be for the level two armor. However, you can get away with the level one armor, but obviously level two is going to look better. You can see here, this is the level one armor. We are going to be using this red and black palette in zone A. And if you go to zone B, we are going to be using the darker green accent. You can see very beautiful. We're going to actually put the level two armor or the advanced armor, and you can see it will look a lot better with that because of the wings in the back. Uh, let's just go back to the full set, but here you guys can see this is the one that we went with the red and green and that will match very well with the qxr from secret santa look at this a beautiful look and i kind of have to do it like this unfortunately i wish i could have been able to do like a a better style but i can't actually go to like battle royale or multiplayer but anyway this is the best way i can show you guys how the skin looks very beautiful you can see it's got the green it's got the nice amount of um, red on the side with the gray you can see the same thing on the qxr and if you want to have a build this is the build that we went with um again it's a qxr nothing crazy but again it worked really really well together so that's my number seven we're actually gonna go with the purple in zone a the kind of chromey vibe and then in zone b we're gonna go ahead and put the gold i really love the gold the gold here looks so nice you can see it got a gold and kind of purple chrome vibe very beautiful and combine that with the kn44 color spectrum not exactly a match but it's very similar because of how the rainbow looks if it was the old can color spectrum it wouldn't have worked but this one works really well you got a little movement coming in with the gun you also got the movement on the i guess the color movement on the chrome with the gold this is a very nice looking gun you can see oh man look at that when he moves that beautiful can build that we're using if you guys want to check it out is this one muzzle like great rangers no stock again this is just a build if you guys want to use it you can if not just use your own but this goes very well with that specter skin number five you guys will see we're going back to that dark green palette and we're going to add some more green to it very subtle darker green you still have some decent amount with that green camel moving again we're using the level two armor so very nice amount of green very subtle very good and you combine that with the hg40 ghoul bound you can see that works very well the green is almost identical and you can see there's a little bit of dark green accents onto the gun so you can see all that combined together makes a nice green ranger kind of look but that is very nice and if you guys want to use the build i actually only have this for a few more days so um, i had to make this video with this one but here is the build that we rocked it's a uh, pretty solid I really like that build a lot. So if you guys want to use it, here you go. 
All right, number four, we're gonna go with the base gold, nothing added to the side. We want to still have that little silver accent. I thought about maybe putting the chrome, but the chrome doesn't give that silver pop enough. It looks more like an iron area rather than the silver. So we kept it this way and you combine that with the Odin, but the mythic Odin and you can see, oh my goodness. What a beautiful, this is probably one of my favorite ones. The only downside is that, you know, the legs, it's silver more than like, the. it's more silver on the, on the Odin, you know. So that's the only downside, but you can see the gold and the silver and the gray. So very similar, very nice looking one. It kind of gives me uh, Mercy vibes from uh, Overwatch. But again, we don't, we don't need to talk about that one because two different types of characters, to be honest. But if you guys want to use the Odin, this is the Odin build that I was rocking. So pretty cool, pretty nice, but yeah, I mean, that's absolutely beautiful. So number three, this is the only one that you can't make with the level one because it's not available in level one. This is a level two exclusive. You have to get the purple skin and then you go ahead and add the chrome to it, making a very nice subtle chrome to the X amount of purple that you see here. Absolutely very, very, very nice. Absolutely gorgeous. And now we're gonna combine that with the ATR Durandal. However, you can put it with literally any purple. Matter of fact, the M16 that just came out goes very well with this, but I like this ATR a lot better. It has more animation it looks really good and uh, together combined it looks uh, fantastic here's the AGR build if you want to use it it's a very nice build I like using that one all right number two we're gonna go with the neon slash lime green and then we're gonna go ahead and add some dark green again you can also get away with this one to be honest they both are really good but I went with the dark green I think this matches a little bit better and together I'm sure you guys can kind of get this but with the PDW look at the PDW Combine the toxic waste PW with this and it makes a very nice one. You can see the green matches up almost identically. The dark green as well goes well, but again, you can switch with any other green you want. I wanted to use this one because it's nicer and cleaner and that makes a very good dark green ranger. I don't know, do I, I feel like I use a lot of green. Do I like this one better? Do I like the HD one better? I think this one is probably one of my favorite one because of toxic. Here's a PDW build that I went with. I like using this one a lot. So if you want to try it out, here you go. All right, finally, this is gonna be my favorite one. I think I like this combination the most. And if I did do the challenge, this would be the build that I went with. It is a nice Nice red accent in zone A, and then we go ahead and add the gold. So this is very, very nice. It's got decent amount of red, a lot of gold. The gray is right there. Very, very nice skin. I love how the the look on this, man. It's just the gold on this is just so nice. And then you combine this with the M13 Morning Star. You can see how great this is. But not only that, we added the gold on the M13 Morning Star. So that way you got the gold, you got the red, you got a little bit of the gray. So it's almost identically matching with this. You even got the wings on the M13. I definitely feel like I'm going to make a video about these, man. There's so many good character skin combination and I'm for sure misses it. So let's go ahead and take a look at the M13. You can see this is the build that we went with, with the gold camo. I low key may have put the gold camo on the uh, Odin, but I'm not 100% sure, but this is the build I went with. I loved it. It was so good. I, I beamed with this, but oh my God, this in combination with the other one were fantastic. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Let me know in the comments down below, which one of these is your favorite. If not, if you did have your own combination, just let me know in the comments down below because there's so many combinations that you can make with this character and there's so many skins that I don't have for guns. There's so many choices, but let me know what you guys think. I absolutely love this character skin. Is it that much more expensive than the other Mythic? Yes, if you go full ham. I don't think you do need to go full ham on the Mythic, but I really do enjoy it. And I probably will make a video with each one of these guns and how the character looks just because of uh, how unique each gun is. I'm not using any meta guns, so I don't know. I feel like that's gonna be a fun one. All right, that's gonna be it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.